Hey guys, what's up? Uh, we're doing a sit down video today, which feels super weird. I pretty much only do vlogs these days, um, but hopefully that changes starting with this video. Um, so as you can tell by the title, this is a clothing haul. I got them from Romwe, 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 um, or Shein, Shine, She, Who, whatever. Um, everyone you know pronounces it differently but she and Romwe are literally the exact same company i know this because when you order from Romwe, you get packages with the uh like packaging says she and on it and i don't know if that happens with Shein, but i've always used Romwe, and i really like it more as of recently it used to be so horrible and like so like noticeably cheap but i feel like now they have a lot of more like high quality pieces and Typically, the more expensive it is on the website, the more like high quality it's going to be. Um, but anyways, um, without further ado, we can just get into the video. I'm going to try and do a try on portion of this video um, or like insert it on the screen somewhere of me with the pieces on. So I'm just going to like go through these as fast as possible. I also have to leave in like 15 minutes for my wax appointment. So hopefully we can just like blow right through this. All right, so starting with jackets, I thought that would just work uh, mostly because I'm wearing one of them. So I don't know, you can't really see it, but you're going to see it in the try on portion. It's just a denim jacket, it's a little oversized. Um, I can also insert the sizes that I got um, somewhere on the screen, but I really like it. I did order it a size up, I believe, because I wanted it to be oversized, but I really would have been fine getting like my actual size because it's kind of already like made to be oversized. So it is like super big, like that's where my actual arm is. So there's like a lot of extra, but it's really cute. And as y'all can see in like the try on portion, I am like obsessed. The next jacket is this corduroy one. Oh, I also can mention that like the buttons, like you can hear it, they're not very tight. They're like very loose and rattly. So just like keep that in mind if that's like important to you um, or if it will like bother you the sound, I don't really notice it. Um, so this is like a corduroy jacket. It has um, silver buttons and it's really cute. It is really thin, like I wasn't expecting it to be this thin, but I did see like a few reviews saying that it wasn't like a super warm jacket. It's definitely more of like a fashion kind of jacket, but love it. I don't know if this counts as a jacket, but we're gonna count it. It's kind of more of like a sweatshirt pullover kind of moment. So we have this, um, it's all white. This is probably one of the softest sweatshirts or like pullovers I've ever ordered. It feels amazing on the inside. Um, I'm so afraid to wash it because I feel like it's not gonna be that soft anymore or that I'm gonna like stain it or something um, in the wash because I just throw all my clothes together in one load. I don't like to color sort because I'm just too lazy for that. Um, but it has like that like outward seam kind of style that's like really in right now. I got a lot of pieces that look like that. But I again ordered a size up. This is a large. Um, and honestly, if I wanted to be oversized, I could have gotten a medium. Most of the things I got in tops and bottoms are all smalls, um, which a few years ago at Wrong Way you could not do. I was like exclusively ordering larges and I'm pretty much the same size. Um, but now their sizes make a lot more sense. So um, I ordered a large, probably could have got a medium for that like oversized look, but so soft, really like. Okay, we also have this jacket. Anything you get from Wrong Way or Shein, like any kind of website like that, the leather smells really bad when you get it. Um, I don't know, it just smells like cheap plastic, gross, like rubber tire smell. I don't even know how to describe it. It'll wear off eventually, but um, just like know that. And it's not obviously like real nice thick leather. It's like that like thin, like fake kind of looking leather, but it works for me. This is kind of like a leather blazer. So it's very long. It has these little pockets. I think they're real pockets, yeah. These are real pockets, long sleeve. It looks so cute as y'all can see on. I am obsessed. I think it looks like so like chic and like, just like you look like a bad, ooh, I love it. Really like it and it fits super good too. Moving into tops, this is the first top. 
that I'll show y'all. It's so hard to show. Um, I tied it last night. Okay, it's like this. Those like little triangle tops that sits like that. Um, and the back is literally just like ties. This is so flattering. I didn't even realize how like, like cute and like, like, ooh, like when like your whole, like an open back shirt, I've been like looking at them. They're kind of coming back into like style. They look so good. Like they just make you look so good. And it's like, just like this like sexy kind of thing, but it's like not really showing anything in the front. And then you see the back and you're like, oh, I don't know what it is. It's very like sexy without really showing anything. Next is this tie dye brown tank top. Not really much to it. Probably wish I would have sized down. I got a small and I could have gotten an extra small. Um, I just wish it was like more tight um, and then it would kind of like flatter the chest a little bit better. But I really like the colors and the like cut of it I think is really flattering, especially if you have like bigger um, things to work with. So I do like it though, very cute. The next one is this turtleneck. It's not my fave, I think I got a small in this as well. It's more of like a, if you can see, it's like a knit kind of material more than like a ribbed like regular shirt, which I don't love, um, especially like going into spring. I kind of just wanted like some turtleneck basics to like put under things. And this like knit, I feel like it's something that needs to be worn on its own. Um, but I do like the color and it is just like a good basic. Like the color is like a nice like tan brown color. So so cute, but I just like, I wish it was more of a normal material. Speaking of, we have another turtleneck for layering as a basic. I have like no basics. So a lot of the stuff in here is like very plain because I just needed to like build that part of my wardrobe. So plain white turtleneck, it is ribbed material as y'all can hopefully see long sleeve this is much longer than like i expected it to be um and it is like pretty see-through like even if you wear a nude bra you'd probably still see the bra underneath not like horribly but like noticeably so i'm probably only going to use this for layering or if i'm going to wear a jacket over it so like you wouldn't really see it um but it is like a good basic and it fits i will say all the turtlenecks are like really tight around the neck so like i would have to put it on before doing my face otherwise i would like pull the face off while putting the shirt on so keep that in mind another basic top but this one is not a turtleneck um it's just a plain black short sleeve or long sleeve crop top so really nice um i really like the way this looks it is like cheap like you can feel that it's cheap but it's like really stretchy and like none of the like like there's no frays or anything like that like strings coming off and like when it's on you're not going to notice um but i like it really good basic goes with a lot and goes really well with like a high-waisted jean for that like really simple kind of look this is what i like a tank top uh i got is this one so like i said that like raw stitch or like you know like different it's like it looks like it's inside out like that like inside out like mismatched fabric kind of vibe is really in right now this is what i got wish i would have gotten it smaller it came a little bit bigger i think i got a small so i could have gotten an extra small but i really like the colors really like the like style and it's pretty flattering i just wish it was like a little smaller this i love and i need to get in every color it is so cute the straps are a little long for what i would want personally so i know i'm going to be like messing with them a bit but nothing like horrible and it is like a nice like soft satiny kind of feeling um and it's double lined too so it's not see-through at least on me at all and i wouldn't wear a bra with this anyways because it is such like a dainty little top it does like come pretty much like an inch below where like my boobs end so like keep that in mind if you're like bigger than I am. I wear a 34C around that usually. So this fits like perfectly. Love, 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 love it. Next we have another like open stitch. I don't even, I don't know what to call this. Someone please comment and tell me what this like style is called where you can like see the stitching on the outside. Um, but it's another one of those like patchwork kind of tops that are really in. I've been seeing this everywhere. Um, so it is a long sleeve and it ends, it's kind of like a lettuce edge too, um, at the bottom and on the sleeves. It fits really well, not see-through at all. It also ends like right where your jeans would start. So it's not cropped and it's not like a weird shirt length. It's like that perfect, 
like length that like flatters like how the jeans are. You can wear like a cute belt and you'll still see the belt. So really like it. Next we have these two tank tops. They're the exact same, just in different colors. So like I said, basics. Um, so it's just this white one, really cute. And then here is the tan one. I will say they're the exact same top. Like when you order it, you just pick the different color. Um, I got them both in a small. This one has more like tighter ribbing, if you can see. It's like that classic ribbing. ribbing uh, little see-through, not horrible. I probably wouldn't wear a bra with it. Um, I do wish I got a size smaller because like I said, it's not like as tight as I wanted. And in the pictures, um, it just looks thicker and like more like stretchy, substantial fabric. And this is obviously like a very like thin, cheap kind of vibe, um, but still like cute for layering and stuff like that. Um, but then the white one has like a more like wide ribbing, like they don't look the same, which is interesting. Um, but still works. This one is a lot more see-through because it's white and it's like really thin Like you can I don't know if you can like see Yeah, you can like see my nails through it. So that if that helps you the last thing that I'll show is This it is just a black turtleneck. Uh, it's a nice length It's not as long as that white one from before they are like different the other ones ribbed and this one's not ribbed It's just like a regular material and this is more of like a mock neck I would say than like a turtleneck like it's very slight so it looks really good under like t-shirts if you want a like band tee look which I really like nice sleeves not see-through if you did want to wear it on its own because it's black so it's just like easy for that um but I bought it for layering and so I would have a basic lastly is this top that I'm wearing right now it's just like green long sleeve y'all will see in the try on so i'm not really gonna like try and show it but it is like a nice like waffle knit to texture it is so soft it feels so nice um so i would really recommend i think they only had it in like two colors though and i will also say it looks more of like a easter light like airy green like a very like baby green i don't know how to describe it it just looks very light and like eastery kind of shade like very pastel green and in person, it looks more of like um, a sage kind of vibe. So just keep that in mind, like the color came a lot more muted than it is on the website. So, okay, the lighting looks different. I'm sorry, I had to go to my wax appointment, but um, I only have a few more things. So we're just gonna like finish it up and be done. <laughs> um, I did forget a top, so I can just add it in. Um, this is a little zebra moment. It has like a point at the like stomach and it's just like a really flattering shape it like makes your waist look really like snatched um and the back is like open back and then there's like a little tie like tie it's so cute i'm really loving the open back and i kind of want to get like more tops with an open back so cute so flattering now onto the pants that i'm so excited about um all of the pants i'm so excited about but um yeah okay so these are some leather joggers, same thing as the other like leather blazer. It's like that like cheap, like not thick, like nice leather at all, but it looks like leather, if that makes sense. They do make like a like, swishy sound. My roommate said it kind of smells like paint, like a rubber paint. So that helps. Like I said, it'll wear off, but just like keep that in mind. I wish that the ankles were a little bit more like cinched. They're like a little loose on me. Um, I think I got a small, like I said, I'll put all the sizes on the screen, but really like it. They're super cute and they just give that like more like chic or like elevated sweatpant look. So if you don't want to look like kind of like bummy, you can wear like these, like a little crop top or even like a little jacket and a crop top. Like, oh, I can like this picture. The outfits are so good. Now we're getting into jean territory. And when I tell you I made this order specifically for the next three pairs of jeans, I am like not kidding him. I literally am obsessed. Um, so all these are in a small, which fit really well. Okay, so the pants, these are the first pair. They are cow print. Can we tell that I like cow print? I do a lot. Um, they have them in black too, if you're interested in like black instead of brown, but I thought the brown was like cool and unique because I feel like the black cow print has like kind of been done like so much. So I kind of just wanted like a cool, um, like different color while still being cow print. They're like a more of a straight leg, almost wide leg kind of style. Um, but the waist is like super fitted, like fits perfect as y'all can like see in the try on. 
so I really like um like all the other buttons the this button is like the exact same as these these are like literally the same um and it is like also loose so just like keep that in mind if you want to like be careful so it doesn't like pop off or anything these next two i don't know which one i like more because they're like very different vibes but um they're also super wrinkly because i did run them through the wash like i said before this because i wanted them to like kind of shrink up and like stiffen a little bit so here is one of them they are this all of these are like the same cut like very like straight leg almost wide leg like not tight at all except like in the waist they're like really fitted there's just this like pink with red hearts i love it i'm so glad i have it in time for valentine's day because i feel like i can like wear this even with like the little red like top that i showed you earlier and like a, like love it. oh my god i it's so good it's so good um anyways so really like them okay this is the finale these pants i have seen on all of my favorite like fashion tiktok people people that i think are like so stylish i've seen this like style of pant everywhere but like these pants specifically i've seen people wear and buy and they look so good and i just i just wanted i, just, I needed to have it and here they are are we kidding are we kidding they're so good so as you can see they're like the raw hem they have a raw hem as well um but they're like that like stitched like mismatched jean fabric and they're so cute so flattering they look so good like the straight leg is super flattering the waist fits me perfectly um and it just like it just is in all the right places the only like complaint i would have about them is that the crotch is like very long like that's like really long to me there's probably like an extra like this much in like space down there if i don't like pull them up all the way if i pulled them up all the way they would probably be like up to like my chest like all the way so i don't like yank them up like urkel or style you know but um yeah they still are so cute and now they're like a little more like stiff and like denim-y after washing them so i'm like really happy that is it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, let me know like what pieces you're going to get or if you already have some of these or um, like your recommendations. If you want to like tell me things that I should buy, I love buying clothes. It's like actually a disease. Um, anyways, you can leave that in the comments below. Um, and you can give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, and if you want to see me do like more haul kind of videos. Um, I have some shoes coming in tomorrow and I bought two jackets from Target, so yeah um anyways uh you can give that a thumbs up and you can subscribe if you're feeling extra nice and hopefully i will see you in my next video bye guys